Hello everyone, my name is William. I am the CTO and co-founder of uh, Nor AI. I started my Japanese journey about three years ago, and after two years I was quite fluent in both reading and listening, but I still could like barely speak. So <laughs> eventually I did contact a Japanese tutor and we started practicing. And over time that actually went quite well. But as you know, the only problem with a real tutor is that it's like really expensive. Uh, you also have to schedule it every week and if you, and if you come home stressed from a long day at work you still sort of have to do it. Also like emotionally you know especially when you're starting out uh, maybe you don't feel very confident in your skills and you sort of have to sit there and talk to this person. So towards the end of last year I got really excited because I saw a lot of uh, sort of AI platforms popping up to practice your conversation skills but I was really really disappointed very fast when I actually tried the products. Um, a lot of false promises uh, inside the app versus what they said outside. Um, also quite poor performance, UI and UX wasn't there. And um, yeah, so I just put together my own team basically because to build like a really, really good conversational tutor for Japanese that has so many of its quirks and its different languages and alphabets, you kind of want, you know, this toolbox, this Japanese toolbox to really do it really, really well. So uh, without further ado, let's jump into it and I will show how it looks inside. Yeah, so this is the main home screen that you will see once you sign into Nora for the first time. And as you know, we are specifically, you know, built in order to feel like a real tutor, but with all the tools that you need to really supercharge your journey to fluency. So the free talk is going to be the main mode where you can talk about anything, initiate any role play. But uh, we also added a, quite a few, you know, role plays and topics if you are feeling a bit low on the creativity side and just want to, you know, jump into something right away, such as at the restaurant or talking about the weather or, you know, whatever it might be. So let's uh, jump into a free talk mode right now. Konnichiwa. What do you want to talk about today? Konnichiwa. What do you want to talk about today? Konnichiwa. So as you can see, I made a little particle mistake here on purpose, just to show you how it naturally corrects you when you're speaking in Japanese. Uh, this is a good moment, I think, to show the, the settings themselves. So right from the chat, you can actually access quite a lot of settings here. So you can set the bilingual mode, for example. So right now it is set to bilingual, which means that you can speak both English and Japanese to the tutor and also get responses back in both English and uh, Japanese. And here it also sort of adapts to your level. So if you speak a lot of Japanese, which I'm doing now, it also replies a lot in Japanese. But if it noticed that I'm sort of struggling and maybe use a lot of English, it will uh, also adapt to that. So it's quite, uh, quite cool. You also have the formality level. Uh, I'm going to leave it informal for now, but let's say you want to practice more casual speech with your friends. It's really easy to do that as well. So you can get some good practice with that thing. Right now I have the correction mode set to strict, which means that they will, for example, now really, you know, get into the nitty gritty corrections on the particles and whatever it might be. But you might also just want to have it sort of on flow mode and just, you know, practice, you know, the volume of the output and not have as much correction. So that is an option as well. And lastly, you can choose the talking speed. So let's get back here and um, let's say we didn't understand this. And we can ask you to explain it. Sorry, can you explain the last sentence? Of course. I said, Donna restaurant ni ikitai desu ka? Which means what kind of restaurant do you want to go to? Is there a specific type of restaurant you like? Yeah, so another really cool thing that I haven't even showed you yet is that let's say you haven't seen this before. You can actually hover to see all the, the readings over the kanjis. And also if you press it, you have like your own personal JMD popover that will show you all the readings, different uh, definitions, can replay the words. Um, yeah, so if you uh, use use your own uh, Jomichan when you're reading, for example, we have it fully built in, works magically. Uh, you can also reread a sentence, like take a short one like this one here. You can use it the same, but in slow mode. 
今週末はどんな予定がありますか Yeah, so that is basically how the app works on the inside. Then you have some other various settings to explore. We have a lot of、uh, gamification and progress stuff coming up right around the corner, so look out for that. And、uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this demo. <laughs>